everyone, I'm Vicky, welcome to my channel. If you are new, please hit that subscribe button. If you are already part of my little sub family, thank you so much. So today I've got a little haul from Country Baskets. I ended up going there with my mother-in-law and sister-in-law. Um, Hay Bales has already uploaded her little haul. Um, the reason why we went there is because I wanted some artificial poppies because I would like to make my own poppy wreath for Remembrance Day. Um, I do not have the fake poppies. Uh, Michelle has got them because she's got her own craft room. So I am going to hopefully put that into its own video of me making this poppy wreath. Um, if you want to watch that then cool, if you want to skip past it that's also cool. So I will show you what I picked up from the country baskets. Um, I don't have the receipt so I cannot tell you what price every individual item was. What I can tell you is that I ended up spending £26.81 on all the items that I've got. Um, this doesn't include the stuff for the poppies. If you've never been to Country Baskets, it's near Leeds slash Wakefield. Um, it's a bit of a wholesaler's, but I would say that the prices, some of some things are cheaper than what you can get in normal stores. Some things are the same price and some things are a little bit more expensive. you just got to shop around. Um, like I say, we did go there for a purpose and we managed to pick up what we actually went for. But as always, when I'm out shopping, I always tend to pick up other stuff as well. So I'll now show you them. There wasn't really a lot of stuff for autumn, um, but there was so much stuff for Christmas. So I ended up picking up these um, four red huge baubles. Um, they're a really good size, but these are for outdoors. So this is why I wanted some big ones, just to put them outdoors on the tree that we have at the front of our garden. Um, for these four, it was 2 99 I also got this red and gold one. Um, kind of like a diamond shape. This is also to go outside. So I think this might have been $1.99, but I'm not 100% sure. And again, for Christmas to go outside is these six baubles. They have like shredded tinsel inside them. So a pack of six in gold. Sticking with seasonal, I'm just going to move on to this heart. Um, this is going to be decorated for Valentine's Day. So in February, I'm going to have this decorated um, to hang up on my wall or my door. I just thought I would continue with the theme of decorating the house for a certain occasion. So yeah, I'm not a fan of the chicken wire that is in the centre of it, but um, I am thinking of a way to cover this up. I picked up this little tiny glass jar, um, it's plain but I want to maybe put some string around it or a ribbon just to make it look a bit more fancy and um, so it's only a little milk bottle and then I picked up some fake lavender so I'm thinking about cutting some of these stems off to fit inside this little glass bottle. So an area of the store that I wasn't expecting to see is um, everything that you need for a funeral. So when you're making funeral flowers, um, there was all of that stuff. And then there was also some nice things to put next to the grave and such. So I ended up picking up this um, like fake rock. It says, in loving memory of someone very special, always loved and sadly missed. And it's got um, some butterflies on it. So my dad wanted something to put next to my mum's grave that was from the both of us. I'm not a huge fan of having loads of random little um, bits and bobs around a headstone, um, but I thought that this was nice and kind of tidy and small and um, hopefully it will look okay there. Um, I don't know if my dad is going to like this. Um, I didn't really want to make it to personalise and segregate the rest of the family away so that is why it says um, in loving memory of someone special. Uh, my mum liked butterflies so I hope my dad will like this and we will just pop it down next to her headstone and then that can be our little something. I saw this like little bauble or little sign um, it says thinking of you at Christmas mum um, so I just thought this would be really nice for me and Dan to put on our Christmas tree. I did plan on picking one up for my sister in a heart shape that's more plain because my sister has more of like a modern tree. Um, unfortunately I picked up the wrong one and it says special wife instead of mum. Um, so I'll see if my dad wants this one um, and I'll just have a look around for another one for my sister. And the last item is something dog themed. Um, the R has rubbed away a little bit while it's been in my bag, so I'll just have to get a, a pen and just rub that back in or something. Um, but it's this sign that says, you got a letter today, it tasted important. 
Now, Charlie can't get to our mail, but if he could, there would be nothing left of it. He would rip it to shreds. So I thought this sums Charlie up to a T, um, and I thought it was quite funny, so I got this. So that is everything that I picked up from Country Baskets. Um, just a load of stuff that I didn't even know that I needed, but now I have it. Um, if you've watched this till the end, thank you very much. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Hopefully see you again soon, but for now, goodbye.